Hello goat lovers, Crystal here with Blue Cactus Dairy Goats. And if you're new to the channel, last October we bred 22 does to six different bucks, 19 of which took. So 19 does gave birth between February 25th and March 13th. That's right guys, 19 does had their babies in a 16 day period, leaving us with 48 bouncing little baby goats on the ground. 26 of those were does and 22 were bucks. Now we did have six losses, which is to be expected uh, when you have this many goats, but all things considered, this has been a very, very successful kidding season. We are retaining eight does this year, and up first is Dinky. Now Dinky, the name just stuck, so that's gonna be her name. Uh, it's pretty fitting. Dinky is a daughter of Dreamer and Vader, and she is blue-eyed and pole. And originally, we did sell little Dinky here, but um, the night after we sold her, that evening, she actually separated from her mother, and I found her the next morning huddled up by a water bucket and ha almost froze to death. So I was able to revive her, um, but I did offer the buyer another one of Dreamer's does just because I wasn't sure what the outcome for her would be. Um, she is super awesome and healthy now, though, so she's good to go. Up next is Little Lodi, or Lidai for short. Um, Lidai here is a daughter of Lodi and Merle. Uh, she is brown eyed and horned. And originally I thought she was pulled, but that's because she was just so slimy. Uh, once she was all cleaned up and dried, I did realize she was horned. She's a good little girl. All right, up next is Daisy. Uh, now this little girl is a daughter of Dawn and Merle, and she is blue eyed and horned. Um, she is something, I haven't seen this coat pattern since Cammy was born. Um, Cammy's mom was actually looked just like this and had this coat pattern, but she rejected Cammy. Um, and at that time I just wanted to sell her and I've always just kind of uh, regretted it really. So I'm just super, super happy to actually have this coat ba pattern back into the herd. So up next is little Tippy here. Uh, Tippy is new blood we're adding to the herd. She is a daughter of Tansy and Merle. She is blue eyed and pulled. And poor little Miss Tippy, she actually had a bout with constipation, um, which really, she lost quite a bit of weight, not eating very well. Uh, but she's doing awesome now. She's back to good health and she's gonna be just fine. All right, up next are these two little beauties. Um, they are also new blood we're adding to the herd. Uh, they are daughters of Becky and Legend, and they're both blue-eyed and horned. Now this little girl was the first daughter that Becky had, and she is just gorgeous. And this is the second daughter that Becky had. Now this little girl was super, super weak for quite a while. Took her a few hours to get up on her feet, but she is just healthy as can be now, bouncing around like nothing ever happened. So, awesome little dose. For these two, I am still struggling with some bee names to come up with. I have some ideas, but nothing is settled just yet. And lastly, we have these two little cuties. Now, these two are daughters of Ruby and Lucky. And this girl here, I know. I have decided to name Miss Jazzy Ray after a longtime subscriber, commenter, and patron. And she is just awesome. She's got brown eyes and she is horned but she has this flashy buckskin pattern that it's a buckskin that has the roning in it, which is something we don't have in our herd. So I'm super excited about her. And this little doe, she is brown eyed and pulled and I am naming her Ruger after my favorite little subcompact. Uh, this is the little girl that I found that had the birthing sack over her head still and I was able to save her. Um, took her a little bit to get on her feet, but she is doing awesome and, and super healthy now. So those are the eight does that we are retaining this year and all other 40 kids have been sold. They will be going to their new homes all across the country at the end of April and we have so much to get done to make sure those kids are ready to go. On top of that, we are milking 19 does twice a day and we are feeding all of that milk back to the kids. Once the kids are all gone, that milk is gonna be for the family. So we're gonna be able to start making cheeses like farmer's cheese, chev, mozzarella, hard cheeses like cheddars, Colby's, Jack's, butter case, uh, desserts like ice cream and caramel. And of course, the soap business is coming this fall. So that is the tally for the 2021 kidding season, guys. 19 does gave us 48 kids, 26 of them were does, 22 of them were bucks, and we are retaining eight does. So that is it for today, guys, and we will see you again soon.
Babe! Yes? Which one is it? Which one is what? The cuteness overload button. Ah, uh, it's C1. Oh, there it is. <laughs>